white and long. Three characteristics of a white lab coat. Although a white lab coat has many different like meanings, my lab coat holds a special meaning to me. By raising hands, how many guys know this one thing a white coat can symbolize? Well, for those of you who didn't raise your hand, or maybe those who did raise your hand but didn't know the quite reason my lab coat symbolizes, my black coat symbolizes a person with a medical degree, an MD degree who went to medical school and who have also, of course, went to undergrad and became a doctor. With becoming a doctor, I more specifically want to become a surgeon because I believe that a surgeon saved more lives and that's why I want to become a doctor. All my life, I want to become a doctor because I fan, I fan to the idea of saving lives and making life better for the great. My name is Keith Lamont Watson Jr. and today I will tell you all about why I want to become a surgeon. For the past 17 years of my life, I want, I've always aspired to become a surgeon, but I had to meet the requirements. One main requirement is education. And as I've, and as I've been growing up, my family has instilled it into me at a young age that education is key. And that education is the only way to be successful in my life or in my story. Point one, surgeons save a whole lot of lives. Unfortunately, they didn't laugh. every second of the day, someone is dying. And if just a percentage of that one of that one day can be saved, then that's change. Any change is necessary or it's great. With being, with being a surgeon, I'll also care for my patients and make them a better person. Because although there are some diseases that are fatal, their life is gonna be prolonged for the, for the best. With saving lives, my patient can be a mother, a father, a brother, a sister, or a cousin. Again, audience, by raising hands, how many of you guys has had a family member that was a patient? Right. How did you? I, I know. Well, I'm, I'm, it's a, that's a rhetorical question. But I know that you had some type of doubt in your eyes with the surgeon at hand. Sometimes it didn't be successful and they did the best they could, but that was still a change that the surgeon gave you. They were able to tell you the facts. They were able to keep the patient or your family member alive as long as possible. They had you, the patient's family, in good hands. And that's what I want to do. I want to change lives in that instance as well. I want to have my patient family at my best interest or their best interest. I just want to make the world a better place. At the end of the day, when I finally become a surgeon and I finish my undergrad degree, go to medical school, and be a successful doctor, I want to be able to say, hey, at the end of the day, I saved lives. I did what I said that I was put on this earth to do. I was successful at what I said to myself as goals. And that's all about me. I like to set goals and I like to prove people wrong who doubted me. And I like to be able to tell myself that I am great and that I am a better person, which is why I told you the story of what I aspire to be when I grow up, which is be a surgeon. <laughs>